We're gonna be doing a video that one of our Instagram follow followers requested. Basically, told us to do a video on how it was to grow up in a Dominican household. Um, by the way, if you know we have stuff on our faces, oh, yeah, I no, this is not us without makeup. Our skin doesn't look crazy like this. Well, my skin looks crazy, but you know, what's it called again? Um, we something Mondays. What's it called, Jenny? What's up, okay? Beautiful okay, Mondays. Mondays. So every yeah. Monday, beautiful. we're gonna post. Either with a mask, we could do a hair mask, we could do our nails, we can do anything. We're just gonna take care of ourselves on Mondays. Lay off the extra product. Um, today we're wearing. I'm acting like we yeah, I was, I was about to tell you. Today we're wearing just to clarify, jelly face mask from Lush. This is not a sponsor, so. This um, is actually good. And what this does, it says, get luminous glow with scrubby bamboo, um, I don't know what the word says, papaya juice. So basically, glow up. Yeah. <laughs> so it makes your face nice and bright. I've never tried it, I've only tried it a few times. I've never tried it, I've only tried it a few times. I've never tried it, I've only tried it a few times. I've never tried it, I've only tried it a few times. I haven't really seen much of a diff, but... My face is getting stiff right now. My face yeah, I feel like I got mad mm -hmm. Botox on my face and I can't smile. Is this how it feels to have Botox? Probably, I'll mm -hmm. tell you shit. Like this? Yeah. Or like, talking back. Like, I feel like when Kylie, like, or thing, I feel like her lips are always just plump. Like, so they're always just like, mm -hmm. so you can't move them, so. <laughs> Yeah, so I was like... I low-key need some lip fillers, though. <laughs> I got lines as lips. No, uh You said lion? Lines. Linea. Oh. Uh. Okay, so getting to the video. Let's see. What's the first thing I could say about living in a Dominican household? Um, so the first thing I'm going to say is when you go over somebody's house, over somebody else's house, you are not allowed to open the fridge. A Dominican household, yep. Yeah. Or ask for anything, or ask for juice unless they offer it to you, or say you want more. And if and if you eat at that person's house, and you leave the the losa in, in the fregadero, if you leave the the dish in the in the thing, that's instant. You're getting the endless boche from yeah. your mom. So what I said is, if you leave a dish in the sink and you don't clean it, my mom is like that too. Like my mom would not only would my mother make me clean my own plate, she would make me clean Everybody. the rest of the dishes that are in the sink. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if you go out with a Dominican man and you are meeting his mom, yo, all you gotta do to win her over is go wash the dishes. Yep, after everybody's done eating. Yep, go wash the dishes and that's it. You mm -hmm. want her? Ah, pero mira, ya es oficio. Yep, I hate for. Oh my god, <laughs> the so word oficio means chores. Yo, I can't stand the word oficio. Yo, for real. What else? What else um, is something? something that Dominicans all do, I feel like. They speak with their nose, they be like. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> They're mad nosy. Ah. I'll be like, my mom, I'll be on the phone <laughs> with like a, a, a job interview person and she'll be like. Mm -hmm. Like, yo, sis, mind your business. It's not for you. <laughs> yeah, they be like. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe like a fucking. My face is sticky. Right now. I don't ever. I don't know if you guys growing up, you had to like hinkarte. Oh yeah, well, I didn't have to do that. Oh yeah. So my dad just um, gave me ass. Growing up, my house was very Dominican. My parents would make me put my hands on the wall, get on my knees, and I would have to stay like that till my dad said it was time to. Put your hands down. And yeah. if you would put your hands down, that's a fucking whooping. 
<laughs> my dad will come in the room with his belt like this and come out and check. Come yep. in and out. And if it was me and my brother and my sister all like this and we was dying, we was making jokes <laughs> as kids. <laughs> <laughs> and we used to get the illest pelas, yo. Yo, my household, yo, my hair looks crazy. But in my household, my dad used to make me, we used to be out in public, and I did something crazy, and my dad used to make me remind him that he has to give me an ass whooping. <laughs> and if I did not remind him, he's going to give me a ass whooping times two. So when I was little, I had to go up to him and we were hope saying, oh, you have to give me an ass whooping. Crying. I said, oh, yeah, I remember, I remember. Then, and that's fucked up. Yep. And he used to make me go pick up the belt. Yeah, I used to be like, pick the belt. And I used to pick the skinniest one. Yep. That's the one that hurt the most. Yep, I picked out the skinniest one. And he beat my ass. And he said, and another thing is they say one word for each ass open. Like, don't ass open, do, ass open, do. I said do twice. Basically, don't do yeah. that again. No, I got Eso otra. That's two. Yo. And then after they give you ass open, don't cry. For real. Don't cry. Va a seguir llorando. Va a seguir. Obvio, estupida. And todo el teléfono. Voy a llamar a la policía. Toma, llámalo. A mí no me importa. Facts. So I used to be like, you're crazy. I'm gonna call the cops. <laughs> and then my mom used to give me the phone. She'd be like, call him. Call him. Here you go. Here you go. What are you gonna say? That you're being uh, my criada. I never said I was gonna call. I was gonna call the police on my dad. Chill. <laughs> yeah, for real. With a cat. Miss, nice. miss, miss, yeah. Miss, miss, miss. No, for real. Another thing that Dominican parents do is they convert every English word into a Spanish. Word. Can we talk about we stay though? Like I thought. Oh shit! Wait, like I thought we stay. It was we stay. But beef steak is beef steak, and that's their way of saying, be, you know, <laughs> that's their way of saying beef steak. So the whole time, like when I, you know, when you freaking order food, you'd be like, oh, that might be thin. Mm -hmm. There's not a word. <laughs> like, that's, yo, Dominicans are too much. <sighs> yes, guys, if you wanted to know what we say for Vix, we say Viva Poru. What does Viva Poru mean? Vix Vapor Rub. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. Yep. For sure, like a college shirt will say polo che. What's polo che? Polo shirt. For pads, like woman pads, like when you get your period, we say cote. Freaking Dominican say. I mean, the real word is cotex, like the brand. Mm -hmm. What else is there? Cheerio. This, yeah, it's Cheerios. Cornflakes is conflé. Conflé. Um, there's much. Wow, we don't have fucking our own words. Wow, um, there's more. There's more. There's a spaghetti. Well, let um, good words. Mhm. Mm they convert. Literally, they just convert everything into. And then, like, I can't. I know how to say cornflakes, but I can't just be like, ma, I want cornflakes. I gotta say, ma, you gotta go play. Like, <laughs> cause it's a word in my head already. Mm -hmm. Like, and also another thing about Dominicans. They're so loud. You can hear Dominicans from wow miles away. You can detect a Dominican. If you're not Dominican, you're gonna think we're all arguing. Yep. Literally, cause we're all like, literally, when people have been in my house, they have said, "Yo, why are you and your mom arguing?" I'll be like, "Arguing? We just had a fire conversation. What are you talking about?" Like, that's just how we talk. We're just loud. Mhm. Mm and they're always usually on the phones with you. Do you let? Que, que yo voy a vender eso para uh, uh, mad loud, like extra, extra loud. Yep. And always selling their platinum over the phone or yep. selling their property. When like, you get your period as a child, <laughs> when you get your period as a child, they call the whole family. So no, that shit was mad Ya, ella es una señorita. That's really annoying. That's who wants, annoying. Why do I want my uncle to know I just got my period? That's mad nasty. Don't mind the wind, guys. It's really weird. I don't know um, what else? Growing up Dominican was just it's the best. You you um if you have people that are not Dominican or like I don't know if I don't know if it's only Dominicans that do this, I don't know if Latinos do this well, but Dominicans we um we wash our underwear by hand and we <laughs> you know? <laughs> like, Yeah, I remember I remember being in college. I do that and I still put it in the basket for, to wash no Yeah, underwear. I do it after too. 
I remember in college, I used to wash my underwear, used to hang it, and like I used to take it down, like when like my roommates People used to come, come because you don't know they, they don't know about that shit. Yeah, but that's so. just weird. Like, what if you didn't know you're getting your period or something? You're gonna just take it off, and you got like a little spotting, not nothing crazy, on your panty or something. You're just gonna throw it in the hamper. That's, that's kind of nasty. nasty. Ryan used to be like, you wash like the first time he seen me do that. He's like, you wash your panties by hand. I was like, yes, your ex bitch be a mad petty. So now didn't wash her panties. She put it in the laundry basket. He's like, yeah. I was like, she's nasty. Cause I put if you sniff it, like how, niggas is like people is nosy. How about like they sniff it like while they putting it in there and see what that mm -hmm. shit smell like? Ew, oh, that's fucking that's nasty. nasty. That's really gross, actually. And your underwear lasts longer when you wash it by hand, by the way. And it's less chemicals, which is pretty good for you. Mm -hmm. You get the same results, honestly. Like it's not like you for real. Results. The washing machine. Is I put it in the washing around. machine because I just have when I have so many, and I just feel like I just I just need it to be washed. I, don't mm -hmm. know. I just feel like it, it's fresher, but mm -hmm. um. Mm. But yeah, I, I wash it by hand. I like washing my mm -hmm. underwear by hand. So that's something Dominican. Growing up, that other people would not understand. Like people do not understand. What else we do? We convert everything into a party. So literally, it can be a baptism, <laughs> a baby shower, <laughs> a first birthday, a fiftieth birthday, a seventy, a nine, a hundredth birthday, Thanksgiving, Christmas, any holiday. Easter. Yes. Well, Easter's even popping. Easter, yo, Easter's Easter. Lit. Yo, Easter, everybody has, like, not everybody goes to church. My family has always been to church, but not everybody goes to church. But one day, everybody on goes to Easter. Everybody's in church and there's a party after. There's always a party for everything. It could be the Super Bowl. Yo, guys, let me just tell you a story that I called my dad saying, Oh, let's have a little get together for the Super Bowl. Um, I'm just a couple friends, you know. Do you guys think my dad let me just have a couple friends? This nigga invited the whole entire Rhode Island to his house to the point where me and my friends had to go to his room because there was no space for us. It was so embarrassing. And then he didn't even know what to do. He said, oh, I made a VIP for you guys. Like, what, nigga? <laughs> that was so embarrassing. I was so embarrassed. Like, we all had to be crammed in a room. Like, crammed, like, all on top of each other because my dad converted a simple Super Bowl get-together into a party. Yeah. And he got lit. Another thing, if you raise your voice at Dominicans, it's over for you. Over. Yeah. Don't hide your report card, either. Don't hide your report card. I did that all the time. For no reason, though. Yo, also, um, another thing you guys won't understand is that if you go to, if you, the kids are a little older, okay, but if they're, like, growing up still, they're still, like, elementary, middle school, there's a cool <laughs> uh, in the bathtub. Oh, hell yeah. Or, <laughs> or if not a cool it could be the coffee thing or the butter thing. Yeah. <laughs> the butter thing in my you never had the See? big, the big one? The big cool kid, my dad? Yeah, but there's a cool one or something in it for you to Yeah, grab yeah, 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 yeah. So... To save water, you fill that up and you and yeah. you shower like that because that's how they shower over there. Mm -hmm. Yep. Also, we take our underwear and you know how you guys have that puff ball thing that you use. That I puff ball is bacteria to me. Um, we use our underwear. To you wash your underwear, especially wash the lace it. one. Yeah, the lace one is a word for the armpits. <laughs> Everything. People would not understand, like, that's so Dominican. Oh, yeah. Um, what else is something that's so Dominican? When it's your birthday and they be like, you got money, be like, bang, pop, I want that to know you. Know, like, <laughs> see that shit. Money. Again, when they buy you your shit and they be like, that's all I got for $500, three. Like, man, like, three fucking things and they keep the rest. Literally. That shit's annoying. No, it, can, it, can, it, can, it could be your birthday party and all them cards that all the aunties do. That's, that's going right back to your mother's pockets for all the money she yeah. just spent. Like, if I ask for this. You and you're getting a party. A little birthday party for everything. A bujita. It's called a bujita. <laughs> <laughs> I did a bujita for my grandma today. What a flan nigga. <laughs> it's called a bujita. A bujita means noise. <laughs> a bujita comes from the word buja, <laughs> which is noise. Buja means noise, so it's like little noise. Like, <laughs> yeah, like not too many people. Get together. So, but there's still, but there's still a good amount of they people. Still the whole but the thing, but the, the thing is, is not a lot of like decoration and shit. Like that's what we do. You know what the decoration is? Not too exaggerated. You know the happy birthday sign that's mad colorful. <laughs> <laughs> the happy birthday sign that's mad colorful. The decoration from every year. Three yeah. balloons on each yeah. side, like the little like the three balloons tied together on every side, and then Jake. cheese doodles on the table with a cake. Yes. And it's cheese doodles, lays, and a cake. And the plastic um 
goodie cups. bags. And yep, and, and plastic cups and, and red soda. If you get lucky, you get Mondongo that day. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> lucky. And yeah, the yeah. whole family comes to this little as tiny apartment that fits two heads. <laughs> the whole family comes and crams up there. <laughs> and then and then when you cook your cake, this is so Dominican, you gotta pause <laughs> to take a picture. <laughs> so you have to have to use you have to cut the cake with the knife. Just not even cut it, cut it, just like kind of put it in. It, like, and then you have to smile like this. And you gotta a hundred takes of that one. Not only that, but <laughs> I never understood what the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> hey, cause I'm not, yo, honestly, I'm gonna go to one of my aunt's page. See, see but it's so that. fake. It's not so only fake. that, but all the little kids had to go in the front of the table to take a picture, and all the big ones had to go in the back to take pictures. Like it never freaking failed. Oh my god, this kid is still missing. And then you got you have the cake on your face. That's a must. Yeah, it has to be right there. there. And everybody Three. had the gorritos, the little cone hats. Canto, canto, tu complete. I have one. Say cheese. I actually have a picture with my uncle for my birthday. On my wall. I was heated my fifth birthday. It was mad lit. And then my whole ass uncle came with his crew of like little dancers. They used to grind OD back then. And they ruined my whole fucking party. Like every I had to go to sleep and they ended up my mom let them grind all night and I couldn't see nothing. I'm like, wow, I know what they're doing. And I know how to do it too. So just Oh like, my chill. god. Another thing of a Dominican household is it's a house party because it's always a house party lately dominicans been getting crazy but it's a house party and parents are always standing by the door at three o'clock in the morning with their coats on and the kids are like <laughs> and they're like ya, ya no vamos, ya no vamos. and they say yeah. bye to everybody so another conversation they say bye to everybody and then they go they have to do an example of something throughout the conversation and they walk right back to the couch mm -hmm. and they sit and that's another hour and all the kids from the party are laid out on top of my coats all well, of them. Blasting, blasting, blasting. Blasting. Knockout. That's how we can sleep through anything, y'all. Not no more, y'all. I can't. I can sleep through. Crazy. I can sleep through loud music. Uh, I'll probably wake I up. I can't no more. If there's loud music playing, I can still fall asleep, is what I'm trying to say. Like, I can still knock out. Because it's just, it's just the norm. And they always want to take a hundred things of food home. That shit's so embarrassing, y'all. <laughs> Nah, they can't I never just leave, too, I don't leave the party with just a, a, a plate to go. No, they have mm -hmm. to leave with a plate to go for the week. Hell yeah, my mom used to do it and then she'd be like, I'm like, all right. Cause I know I was eating too, so I used to go get it. And then my grandma, my grandma is the worst when it comes to that shit. It's so embarrassing. And the food that we eat, it's like, if you go to a Dominican party, this is what we have at a Dominican party. Moro, which is rice and beans mixed together. Yep. Um, we have penny, which is <coughs> pork shoulder. Yep. We have lasagna, and we call it lasagna. <laughs> we have potato salad, potato um, macaroni salad. salad, green salad, spaghetti. spaghetti, bread, just because, I don't know what the fuck the bread is for, or, t or chicken, because you have to have... I've seen Mara awesome. Wakate and parties too. Like mm -hmm. yeah. that's like when you're going all out, you got Wakate. And and Yuka. Yuka yes. with fucking guineitos and onions. That's just not. What else? Um, there's at least four different types of meats, three different rices, at least freaking seven salads. Yo, there's like always mass salads. The gallina always stays. That shit's not hot to eat. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Chicken wings. Freaking what else is there? Come on, we cute. <laughs> that shit smacks though. That shit somehow still tastes Dominican. Like, there's nothing to me like a <laughs> plate of like moro. Cute. Yo, moro with penne, lasagna, and mm. a soda salad on that plate. Forget it. Yo, like that. Oh, and patelitos. Oof. You have to have the patelitos and the keep it. Mm. Hell yeah. And then on the, at the very end of the table, there's mad cups and mass orders. <laughs> <laughs> In every single party. Man, I love being Dominican. Yo, you know what's so crazy that at the school, so um, a Dominican parent came and they brought a Dominican like chocolate cake to their daughter to cut with everybody. Mm -hmm. And they brought, they brought Country Club and they brought another regular soda, but nobody wanted Country Club. They don't know about them. that Country Club. I'm like, you guys don't know what the soda is? They're like, no, I said. You soda in your you. Good, might as well swing one. Um, but yeah, um, we started. Yeah, there's enough. We start Thanksgiving, this should be. 
Is there? I probably want your mom calls you he like a boot and I'll be like, Ma, you're calling yourself a boot that mm -hmm. she's fucking smack the shit out of you. Yo, my mom wouldn't even let me talk. Like if I raise my voice, she's slapping the my face. Like she doesn't let me talk. My mom didn't really hit me. It was just my dad. My mom hit me bad at your fuck. My dad beat the shit out of me. I got beat, beat for everything, even on my birthday. Cool. On your birthday? Hell yeah. Cause that's when I acted up the most. Thought I could get away with it. Um actually yesterday I got into an argument with my dad, right? And I was so mad about something, and he was on the phone with his brother from DR. And <laughs> I knew I was gonna get the illest boche when he just listened to me. He didn't say nothing. Nothing. And he was like, Tu no ve que yo tengo teléfono? I said, Ay, mi no me importa con quien tu habla. And he, and he went like this. Hi. Right. Oh, you're okay. disrespectful with someone on the phone. And he was like, You know you can't make like, And he's like this. He's like, Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, Tami. So like to me, mm -hmm. when he got off that phone, he's like, Leomari. That's my Dominican ass name. Leomari. Tu no ve que yo estoy hablando por el teléfono? No me haga eso otra vez. <laughs> Do not, yo, because <laughs> Dominican parents love to stunt in front of people. Like, they love to act like something is what is, like, what. And he's, and he's like, Tu no ve que yo estoy en el teléfono con Gino? And then my mom like, si, y van a creer que tú eres una loca, y que hace lo que tú quieras, blah, blah, blah. They always think about what the other family members are going to say. The American kids that don't have fucking wisdom, and yup, no manners. If not, they'll tell you to answer the phone and tell their friend that you don't want to talk to them. And one time I blew up my dad's spot, and I got to ask them. Dile que estoy muerto bañando. Oh, yeah. And I used to be like, and I used to be like, ah, tú estás en el baño. Doing the whole fucking night again. Yeah. Oh, dude, I'm not going to attack you. My father said, I'm not going to attack you. What I really did was, Loco Pablo called. My dad gave him the Loco Pablo name. So I used to be like, I was like, Papi, toma que te llame Loco Pablo. And he was like, And then he got the phone. Hey, no, tú sabes, tu muchacho. Oh, my God. Tu muchacho inventándose cosas. No, no pasa vergüenza nada más. That's not funny. No, yeah, that's too funny. And 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 then they be like that before. They be like. They be like, eh? And they get a little <laughs> silent K on the phone. <laughs> not silent in the in the whole. Movie. No, ya yeah, salió ya. Ella fue para el supermercado. I hate when they have my phone too, cause like my. Mom's friends, like, when they call them my aunt, they'll, then they'll call me and I'll be like, oh my god, I really hate it, because that means you, you never get your phone back. Yo, oh why my mom talking on the phone for three hours? My mom too. She calls her same sisters every single day. Only her sisters. And she talks about the same shit. Mira, muchacho, yo compro una cortina en, <laughs> en marcha. <laughs> Qué bello. Like, I can't. Bien chévere. See, yeah, yeah, be, when I was over here, your mom's sister was there and she went to the room and showed her about the shit. <laughs> <laughs> the white Dominicans love to show shit off my mom. She goes, see, 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 that and they be laughing at her, though, Loki. They all be laughing at each other, but you guys are all the same. They be fake with each other? It's all deep. Yo, my mom and my aunt be scrapping. It's annoying. Because they both loud as fuck. And they both talk too fucking fast. Oh, we made, we forgot the main thing. Yo, we gotta wake up every Saturday to fucking clean, yo. My yeah. fucking early. Oh, that's my chata merengue and all that shit. I fucked no, her mom before. has to be the worst, though. Because she cleans nothing. <laughs> my mom is like... <laughs> Manny and I'm me too. And my room be like a shoe on the floor. No, like, you can leave something like yo, you can leave something like this at her house. And, like it used to oh, be like this. Right. No, it used to be like this. And you leave it like this. It's still neat and it's still clean. She'll send me a picture. She'll send a picture. She <laughs> really sends her picture. She'll text like, a picture like, like, like Is that the way you Like see my it? house ever in my life has ever been a mess. Never literally has my house ever been a mess. My room, forget about it. But my house, never. And there's a two, because when, when I eat, like, growing up, like, I'll be like, before you use somebody's bathroom, open that fucking curtain, because if they're dirty, don't use their toilet. And I feel like I be doing that still. Like, sometimes I go in people's houses and I open the curtain. I'm sorry. My mom was a clean fiend, too. She's still a very clean fiend. Like, she gets frustrated. She gets, like... 
<laughs> she starts like breathing my hard. Brother, like she does. Baby. She starts going crazy. She starts calling me crazy name. Me and my sister being like, <laughs> you know, my sister, like, yo, you stay. Boys, I got cheated. We be like, we be like, yo, you stay. She's like, I'm flexing. I'm like, I'm flexing too. Fuck, I'm not trying to hear this crazy ass lady. <laughs> like legit, we planned it. Oh, like if we have me seen that, if we have you me know, seen like, that. Your mama, your mama, your mama got cheated. Oh, this is bad. Respectful. Kid, if we have you seen that coming, we know they're coming to the next day. Me and my sister Forget. be like, no. you stay here. And be like, nah, I'm like, you stay? She's like, nah, I'm out. Your mom is always like, yo, every time we used to go to Leo's house, your mommy, it definitely. I had to get up when we was younger and clean. She too. was so old. You always had to pray out. My mom, my grandma, she had like a little allergic reaction. My grandma's like, Si que me puse huele amoniaco because tenía um, gripe and I'm like, what the fuck what are the you fuck like your sniffing amoni amoniaco? She's like, para la gripe, whatever, whatever. My mom's like, tú sabes que yo, yo sí le tengo alergia a algo. Como algo tan muy sucio, como el polvo de, de la suciedad, <laughs> me da como alergia, like, la gente puerca, la gente sucia, me da una vaina, mira, lo estoy diciendo en un carro, and I was like, like, I'm like, oh my god, this bitch is so dramatic, like, shut yeah, she up. Was like, oh, she was in someone's car, I don't know who fucking car she was in, and she was like, que le dio alergia, en la nariz. She probably had, like, Ma no, I'm gonna get issues. No, no, like, no, your mom is mom OCD, issues. like, real, real OCD. You know who else is like that Scarlet's mom? Really wow. Yeah. Even when she gets dressed, she's like that. Like your mom she is a legit okay, perfume. Oh, Scarlett's like, mom been cleaning nothing. Nothing. Scarlett's like, no, I gotta stay home. I gotta clean. Scarlett. Well, my mom, I'm gonna be embarrassed in my room. And my room is basically clean all the time. She be like, Sarah, 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 so you wanna be sit down? I no, 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 no. If not, yo, if not, no. When you're little, and your mom has friends coming over, they always want. The friends is kids to go play in your room when you're not old already. Like it's I'm not little girl. before. Like so fuck. I'm not. Lock my door. Like damn, my mom thinks I'm still little, and the kid has to come play in my room. Like my mom be so fuck? fiend out that like I've had come home sometimes and my room's clean. Like <laughs> that's how fiend she be. My like why are you doing that? And then I get livid because now you now I don't know where everything is, and then now you don't even remember where you put it. I, and but, she will not give a fuck. Your and then she called me crazy names after she cleaned it. Crazy. Everything in the book. Then don't clean it, don't touch it. Nobody goes in there. And mom, the day, mom was like, I need more help around the house. I'm like, what do you need help with? And she's like, cleaning. I'm like, cleaning what? Hey guys, this is all from the top of our heads. We didn't plan. Um, we just seen that one of our, because I asked today on the Isamigas page, um, basically, what kind of videos did you guys want to see? So somebody did put, he said that he's been asking for a while, so we felt like we should take it into consideration. Since you, excuse me, since you guys say we never listen to you guys, we wanted to listen to him because he said he asked my times and he wanted us to do this. So this came from the top of our heads. We didn't, we literally didn't plan. Like, yeah. excuse me, that ginger ale. So we, so we missed a whole bunch of stuff, but we hope you guys kind, kind of got like a little taste of what it was for us growing up. It was like... It was tough at the po at the at, like at the point when you used to cry and get uh, ass women, but I would right. never change it. Like, I just love. I love being Dominican. I love to be in Dominican. Oh, yeah. I really love it. I, yo, there's nobody like us. We're like we're very special. We're really like unique. we're so wow. There's no Spanish people like us. Mm -mm. We talk. No crazy. shame. Dominicans have yeah. zero shame. Yo, when you before we end this, yo, when you when you go to uh uh. A corner store with that some like anybody's Dominican anywhere that it could be a cab driver, a corner store owner, it could be anything of anybody being Dominican. This old person automatically acts like you're their kid. Bang, mommy, bang. Literally, I got my head cracked in New York. That's gonna be a story time. But Either I got that or they they'll try to get with you. Yeah, yes, <laughs> a dirty ass uncle. I got my head cracked in New York and a cab guy seen me and he was Dominican, a Dominican like uncle looking nigga. And he spazzed on me like, yo, you getting in this car right now because I'm taking you to the hospital. I started all kind muchacha. He started spazzing on me and he took me to the fucking hospital. That's so, wow. Yeah, like, it's like we're all a family even though we're not all family. Like, as, as long as you're Dominican, you feel safe. It's crazy. But I hope you guys like this video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.